Build more everything. Sprit. We need more feeples. Yes, feeples. I like it. Feeples. Most of the time I don't even know what I'm saying. Science and... We can put better engines on my ship even though I don't actually use those. Still, cool. Arctic, desert, I have a lot of desert in my system. After we get that, I want to get that. Actually, no, I want to get that, then I want to get that. Looks good. Let me dismiss. Yo, we empire battles of the tea. I, I can't sing. Especially rap singing. Wouldn't work. Nope. Arids. Can Karaha do something yet? No. Boop. Can you get like some... Something to do with getting better dust? You can restore those wonders, by the way, and get, like, crazy bonuses. Oh, you know what I just realized? All the Hexferum comes from just this system. We don't actually have the the systems in these two that gives us not hexavirum, titanium. Let's get right on that. Can't. What about here? What's a shattered crust do? Less dust, more industry. Cool. We build in ships. Actually, no, we're not. But we're gonna. We're gonna conquer the world. Or something like that. Core mining. Ooh, yeah, we can see Hexaferum now. We can even we can realize the full potential of our galaxy. This is a great system now that I re see that. Hexaferium and titanium. Nylon, Pavo. Good, good, good. Cool. Gaikon. Can you expand? Yes, you can. Get that. Why is it taking so long to build this? Oh, that's because it can't. It doesn't have enough people. What about Karaha? Karaha can. The Empire. I don't know if you should call yourself the Empire, that has some negative connotations. Nah, yeah, I'm sure it's fine. It's not like we're gonna be like the Empire from that one movie. Got a resource abundance.
I don't really have any need to build ships. That until pirates like invade my empire and we actually are forced to build them. Yeah, it's probably gonna happen. Click on build that. No, actually, colonize that and then build that. We need to increase our science production. We really do. It's really bad to fall behind in tech. In any game, usually. I mean, I'm sure there's a game where it, where it doesn't really matter if you fall behind in tech. But you're supposed to. That's how strategy games work. If there is research you should probably not be the least advanced faction. Typically, that's a bad thing. Cool. Sustainability. Research. Increasing dust output might be a wise move. Let's get that and then could keep going into industry. Improve our colonies. Get the ability to go through warp gates. Warp gates, is that is it? Wormholes, whatever. Same thing. Star Trek nerd just died. It's not the same thing. I, I know, I know. I know these things. You know what? You. Just get that out there. I don't even care. Go enlighten Dorado. Wanna constantly expand. Actually, is that even being built? No, no, it's still no. Why? Is this food? Not really doing very good in food. Should you research that? Increase food output on my empire, please. And dust. Well, we're not really going into the war tech tree yet, and we haven't really done this policy tree. We're focused on expansion and science and industry. This is like science, industry, food. This is this is one half of the fids, this is the other half. War and systems. Quick run down of the tech tree, baby. Baby. Mm, industry would be nice. How are we doing in Disney? Colonize this jungle. Oh, and that has Hyperium on it too. Get that in our empire. It's a really good resource. Hexaferium. It's a great resource. It kind of was. That's what made or break my session last. Our last playthrough didn't have enough Hexaferium to build our mighty warships. What is this? What does this even do? I want to read it. <clears throat> <clears throat> Using lessons from hardy strains of bacteria and basic soil biology can be changed to improve nutrition, waste cycles, and okay. Stuff. 
Hmm. Please. Good system. Dorado. Feed the people, please. And then... This is gonna be a heavy science system, I think. Arctic, Tundra, Arctic, yeah. Thirty-six. Goikon. That's really good for your industry. Sweet. Oh, dude, Goikon's finally expanded to this four-planet limit. Start really pumping out food so we can get all those to max pop. Five systems. Highest population being in Gaikon at 5. So, surprisingly, pretty small. This is boring. Nothing's happening. Gaikon, do something. You have good industry. Good pop. Build a factory. Takes 201 population, which you do have. Gaikon's only the biggest because it has the most planets. It doesn't have the greatest concentration. It's all pretty much on one pop per planet, pretty much. Koyos, or Koyos. I'm not, I'm, eh, my tongue. It's not working anymore. Stand by thirty thirty seven AD. That just increased our food exponentially, I think. Should be. Because now we should be using alien grafting. Yes. Basically, just no food, which is good. Whoa. After the test. So we created three random anomalies, sweet. So that's why with all those popped up, it already showed four different resources or something like that in the galaxy. Could increase industry, science, no, no science. Science is 20 turns down the line, don't we want to get that? We could prep for alien contact. Could be a good idea. Uh, good treasure increase, pop. Really, just need to increase our science output overall. <laughs> isotopes. I do that for now. I should keep that system occupied for at least a little bit. We are producing three colony ships. I want to take Pavo, Stratus, and Nylon. Anthromedia isn't the best system. I mean, maybe I'll get it eventually. We just ran into either the Empire or the Shriden. Oh, fuck. Okay, quick little lesson for you. Craver's interesting, unique faction. They're not allowed to be at peace with a faction. It's that can't, can't do it. They typically are 
highly warmongering in early expanders. Lower the tax rate a little. Uh -huh. That's that's not good. That's really bad. It might be wise to move the system from either this colony ship from Gaikon straight to there. Make sure neither one of those two factions gets it. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Kura. When are you going to be produced? You're going to be produced in one turn. It would take you longer to get there than I So I'm just going to move him to Pavo. Do I actually have any ex- Yes, I do. I don't like them exploring my system. I feel like they're going to hurt me. Or planning to. Also, another interesting fact. Um, Shriden, they are considered an evil faction. They're not as bad as the Cravers, per se. But they're, they're still... Generally speaking, not the best. I don't think we can hold out against the Craver invasion. Mm. Might be wise to tech tree and get for better food, which is here. Ipregne hips. Oh, it's just oof. words and galaxies in a galaxy far, far away. Stuff happens. Let's explore my gal my systems, why don't you? Icon make mo factories even five turns. Do that, please. The system's not growing fast enough. Dismissed. Stand by. Uh, ow. Oh, there's so many choices for you to get. That's a large air. It's probably one of the best to start off with. We got a rich atmosphere for extra happiness and crop growth. Get evolved soil so we can expand quickly and take these other systems. Then I want to capture probably either Stratus or Nylon. I'm thinking Nylon. N nail. Nail. 